Hey there! If you are enjoying the jokes we create for you, please subscribe to our channel. Let's start the joke of the day. An airline captain was helping a new blonde flight attendant prepare for his first overnight trip. Upon their arrival, the captain showed the flight attendant the best place for airline personnel to eat, shop, and stay overnight. The next morning, as the pilot was preparing the crew for the day's route, he noticed the new attendant was missing. He knew which room he was in at the hotel, and so he called him up, wondering what happened to him. He answered the phone in distress and said he couldn't get out of his room. You can't get out of your room? The captain asked. Why not? There are only three doors in here. The man groaned. One leads to the bathroom, one leads to the closet, and one has a sign on it that says do not disturb. A young man goes into the job center in Sydney and sees an ad for a gynecologist's assistant. Interested, he goes to learn more. Can you give me some more details on this job? He asks the clerk. The clerk pulls up the file and says, the job entails getting the women ready for the gynecological consult. You have to help them out of their underwear, lay them down, and carefully wash their private regions. Then apply shaving foam and gently shave off the hair, then rub in soothing oil so that they're ready for the examination. There's an annual salary of $75,000, but you're going to have to go to Perth, other side of the country. The man says, oh, is that where the job is? The clerk says, no, sir. That's where the end of the line is right now. A young man approaches a fisherman standing in the river. He waves to the fisherman and says, wow, great pull you've got there. The fisherman smiles, gives a slight nod, and says, Thank you. And man, that's some of the coolest tackle I've ever seen. The fisherman smiles and nods proudly. Thank you. Some high-quality bait, too. Thanks again, says the fisherman with a big smile. The young man peers down into the river, curious. You know, he says, the fish don't really come through here this time of year. Yeah, I know shrugged the fisherman. Then what are you fishing for? The fisherman replies. Compliments. It was a man's 80th birthday and his friends wanted to get him a special gift. Since he was a widower of many years and after some discussion, they decide to have a hooker come to his house that night and give him the time of his life. Later that evening as the old man was getting ready for bed, he hears the doorbell ring. He opens the door and sees a hooker standing there in a sexy outfit. She says to the senior, Hi there, I'm here to give you super sex. The old man thinks for a moment, then says, I'll take the soup. A man is lying in the hospital, waiting to be the first person in history to receive a brain transplant. A doctor comes in and says, Congratulations. But unfortunately since this is a new procedure, your insurance isn't going to cover it all. So we're going to give you three choices for brains, and you can decide which you can afford. Okay, what are they? Says the man to the doctor. The doctor says, Well, first there's engineer brain, that's $100 an ounce. Then there's astrophysicist brain, that'll cost you $200 an ounce. Finally there's politician brain, that's the most expensive at $1,000 an ounce. The man looks at the doctor, surprised. That's absurd. Why is the politician brain so expensive? The doctor turns to him and says, Sir, do you have any idea how many politicians it takes to get an ounce of brain? <laughs>